Hi, everybody. It's a gorgeous day again today. It's like in the 80s. So it's a rain, then three days in a row after that. We'll see. Then it'll be like 70s and 60s. Still nice weather, though. I'm not complaining. But today I actually can wear sleeveless and I have on my flip-flops. Awesome. Oh, I'm going to sit here on these stupid masks. Well, guys, I went to the pain doctor today and they're cutting me back on my meds. So hopefully that'll be okay. But um, let's see, did I bring it over here or not? Oh, yeah. But I got a freebie. Victory over pain. My doctor and uh, one, two, three, four, six different pain doctors uh, collaborated and wrote this book. So um, I'm going to read it. I was kind of reading it. It's sitting there. It's big print. I'm going to read it. I'll pass on the information. Victory over pain. It's. Secrets to a life with less pain and more joy. And heck, we all want that, don't we? Of course we do. So I will let you know what this book says. Alrighty. Um, I found some more things in our van that I bought, apparently, or I just ran into a yard sale and then came back up and just picked one or two things up. But first, I want to show you uh, some things that I got as friend mail. And, um, well, I don't want to break anything here because friend mail is very special. I'll set that there. And it was all so super cool. Everybody gives me the most super cool friend mail. All right, the first one came quite a long time ago, and I, I've opened these things up, but um, it did come quite a long time ago. And this came from, let's see if our card's in here. What's in here? What's in here? Nope. Well, I don't see it, so I don't know. But it came from... Um, Maria, California Maria. And um, my nose is itching. This was in the box, which is super for the fall and Halloween. This little tiny quilt. And on the back it says 8302000. So, um, you know, I don't know what it's for it honestly looks like a it would fit a pillow you know like you would put on a pillow so i might sew um you know a piece of fabric on the back and use it as a and put it on a pillow for th this fall oh my gosh my nose is itching it's crazy what does that mean when your nose itches you're gonna kiss a fool well, bring them on. All right, so I got that. And uh, then there was some doilies. There's a, a maroon one, which is, um, these are made out, like out of heavier yarn. That one's a good size one. And then this little one. And then there's two of these this size in a blue these would be good for uh when i do my red white and blue stuff i think that'd be cool so i'll probably put them with that stuff Alrighty. righty i'll make sure i got everything out of here now okay um and then there was a um, Tara Redesigns Blue Harbor Collection Christmas mug. Isn't that cute? That is really cute. And nice and big, too. So, it's got that. 
And then uh, this, I don't know. I'm assuming what would have made it light up is missing. Because the bottom looks like this. But it's this adorable little um, penguin. And uh, I'm sure I can do something with him. Yes, I will use him in my crafting somehow. So I got that. And then she had sent me this. She had asked me if I could fix it. And it is this, um, it is a Joseph original and it's not a number eight birthday doll. So the wing is broken off and I will glue it back on and then she'll be good as new. She's very pretty. Very pretty. So, thank you so much, Maria. You always send me the cutest things, and I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. The next thing I got, I'm trying to do them in order of when I got them, was I think last week. And it came, well, this actually is stuff I bought. These are Wade, Wade's Whimsies Animals. There's uh, two polar bears which I'm thinking I'll use them in crafting. And then a lion and a tiger, circus animals. So yes, so I got those. So that doesn't, that's really not friend mail. All right. And then the friend mail was this, I got these the same day, was from uh, shoot, I had it I had it written down. Um, I know who it is. I just can't think of their name. Um, oh, goodness. If I had a brain, I'd be dangerous. It, her, I can't think of her first name. Her channel name is, um, uh, um, thrifting, something thrifting, thrifting. Vintage Thrifting Treasures. Oh, gosh. Vintage Thrifting Treasures. Forgive me. I can't think of your first name. And this is like the second thing she sent me. This, the last thing she sent me. Uh, I've already put it out. I can't think what it was. I'll tell you what the last three weeks is. I can't remember my own name. But this was what she just sent me. And this is the most adorable uh, fox pin. Look at that. Is that not the cutest thing? So I will be wearing this during the fall. Um, I started putting my um, um, pins on... Uh, a black velvet it's framed as black velvet and I will put it on there as well I'll probably have to have more than one because I got a lot of pins but anyway so that is from from my dear friend vintage thrifted stuff <laughs> God, I'm terrible when I do this video I will put her name I'll put everybody's channel and their names uh, below the next one came today. Well, no. The next one I got, it's, I guess it's been in the package box for a couple days, but I didn't know it. And this is from Jane and Happy. She's got her new um, business cards. Bless her little heart. And this was for Ron. This is so cute. I've been wanting one of these forever. So this is for Ron. We'll put nuts in that for him. She said it was for cashews. And then she gave me this beautiful little box that says memories. It's from Avon, 1983. That was your my mom died. And it has a little music box in it.
I can't remember what the song is, though. But then I can't remember my own name. But anyway, so it does play music. And then the bottom part of the dish says, memories are for sharing. It's a beautiful little box. Very, very pretty. And I got room for it on my dresser. And then she also sent me this beautiful silver um, colored um, rose pin. Rose is one of my favorite flowers. That is so, so, so pretty. And I'll be wearing that one as well. So, beautiful friends, um, I love you so much. And I thank you for thinking of me. Um, I can't seem to think for myself, so it's good that somebody is thinking for me. <laughs> and of me. So, um, I just... I appreciate it. I um, I love all you guys, and I've gotten gifts from other people, and I do try to remember to show them and thank you and whatnot. Um, but I just, it, it's just so sweet when somebody does that. I had a, that procedure on down my throat a couple days ago. I'll tell you what, I was so dry I couldn't even talk. It was terrible. But I'm bitter. Still dry, but bitter than I was. Now, so I went to, as I said, some yard sales. And I know that wasn't all 75 cents. And I bought these um, towels with the crocheted top on them. And uh, I bought these, two of them for my daughter, because she loves these things. And this lady put some heavy-duty towels on them, so that's really good. They're not skimpy or those icky kind. And then there's this one, which I've I told Ron, if my daughter does Thanksgiving, I will give I'll give this to her as a hostess gift. Um, if she does not, um, she'll get it at Christmas. That's the other one. And her kitchen's like a I wish it was maroon, but it's more of a plum color. But that was about as close as I could get to her kitchen. So hopefully she'll think they're okay. I don't know. And then I had to buy me one. And it is a flamingo one. I thought that was really cute. I probably won't use it till in the summer. It's got a nice vintage button on it. Um, she picked, I mean, she bought really good towels for this. And anyway, I, I probably won't use it till the summertime when I put my flamingos out for de decor. So I got those. And then I got this pumpkin. Ooh, a stuffed pumpkin. I thought this was really cute. Very cute. I, I love stuff, things like this, and I, this one's nice and big. You want to make a statement, so you have a big, big pumpkin with some little ones around it. That looks always, always looks cool. And um, what else did I get from this lady? Oh, darn it! Um, I bought a styrofoam disc to use for crafting. There was. Two uh, masks in a package for, uh, I thought I'll just stick them in the glove box so we'll have them. Um, I got this beautiful um, cross that was made in Mexico. It's just so pretty. So pretty. And... I bought these plastic, they're size large, things you put over, um, well it says you can put over a crib, 
a grill. So I thought I'd use these to put over our stuff out on the deck for the winter. And I'll just bungee, not bungee cord, but you know, like use zip ties to keep it on. So I got those. And that was all I got. And then yesterday I went to Bethesda. Even though it wasn't Wednesday when I get 25% off, I was being wild and crazy. I thought, well, I'm right there. I'm going to go and see if I can find anything to craft with. And I got a free, free bandana that says, Friendship Trek, Jesus, our forever friend. I'm going to wash it so it will be soft. There we go. Got that. Now, let me start unwrapping. So, I got this little nativity. which I thought was perfect. Um, I got this little snowman ornament. I'm going to take the little thingy off. And that one's a nice, good size. And then there's this um, rocking reindeer. And uh, it's a nice size. Don't, not sure what I'm going to do with them yet. I know, I know I'm going to do something. I just, you know, no baby what I'm going to do, but I'm not sure. Might come up with something totally different. This one actually is pretty cool. This is old, and I think this is Bakelite. Um, I wanted to see who it was made by. It says Chicago. Uh, Yeah, I'm I'm almost positive this is Bakelite. So it's a ketchup. A ketchup container. And I am going to use this for crafting, not for um, resale. Even though I'm sure it would sell, but um, I already have in my mind what I want to make with it. So, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. All right. And then there's this snowman here. It's a hobby piece. And they did a, or a really cute job in this little snowman. He's adorable. Very cute. And then there is this Santa. He's an ornament, which I can take his thing off real easily. He's pretty cool. And uh, I got this, which is by um, Napco Wear, Japan. And it's actually a candle holder, but it's a little sleigh. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be crafting with that. I got these, I, right away I knew what it was, because I have another one, and it's needles, a little thing of needles from Stanley Home Products. However, I'm praying this tag comes off without any mess. I don't know if it will or not. Of course not.
I hate when they do that. Why would they be so stupid as to put it on the front of the thing? I don't know. But it has torn the page, torn the thing like this. The good thing is it's also like this. So you can always use it backwards. Yeah, I don't know why they do that. Very, very, very irritating. I have to say. And then I got um, some gloves. I got this turquoise, or no, not turquoise, like aqua pear right here with a little like a scalloped edge at the top here. They got like a little bit of elastic at the wrist. Oh, how I loved when we all wore gloves and stuff. It looks so pretty. And then I got a white pair with a little, like, it's like a little bow thing on the, on the wrist. Apparently somebody had tried these on. I'll try the other one since that one's got all its fingers poked in. And there it looks like that. I haven't seen any gloves in a long time, so when I saw these, I grabbed them. And this pair are leather. I can get it all the way on. White leather. These are pretty. I'm going to craft with these for sure because I already had in mind when I bought them what I was going to do with them. And I got one Christmas hanky. Um, I got this music box, which is a Christmas one, and it's all blown glass. This is frosted, and then it has a Christmas tree and a reindeer. And I'm not sure what it plays. Oh, let me see who this is made by. There's a sticker on the bottom, if you take off this thing. So what could it be? What could it be? It is... Made in Taiwan by DeVille. Okay, made in Taiwan. So it does have some age to it. Jingle bells, and it goes round. It Twirls around us trying to see if I have anything to sit it on. That's adorable. I mean, adorable. I love that thing. I don't know how much it was. I didn't have a price on I had got to pick up three different things that didn't have a price on Too bad one of them hadn't have been the uh, um, needles. Okay. Then I got a uh, Santa's boot. 
a boot and a little mini um a snow globe with a snowman in it okay what else we got here and then i got these two bells mrs beaumont hallmark Cards, 19, I think this is 1961, I'm not sure, this is Beaumont, she's caroling, and then there is maybe it was 91, and then this is Mr. Ashburn, 1990, Hallmark Cards. I thought those were cool. I never in my life had a bride doll. I got a bride doll. And her eyes closed and open really well. Um, I got this little snowman that's an ornament. Ornament. Um, I got these really pretty um, uh, and they look to be vintage. They have, it says Brooklyn, New York. They're metal frames. And one looks like this. And one looks like this. This one has a, um, as Ron would call it, a hoochie popper to hang it up. The other one has just like a little loopy thing there. I thought those were really neat. I, I've never seen anything like that. I've seen things similar, but nothing exactly like that. And then there's this here, something that's wrapped up. Oh, I thought this was beautiful. Needs to be washed. But, um... It was hand blown and then the bottom has been smooth smooth real well. But look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I just think that's so pretty. Okay. Show that to D. And then I got this, which is an ornament. It was all kind of twisty, turny. Um, but I was going to use that to craft with. And then I got a whole bag of stuff. It is a bargain bag and it was $3.99. So I looked at it the best I could. Well, I was there, but I have not opened it up yet, so we're going to both be surprised. All right. Well, I got some styrofoam balls. I wish they were littler because they're too big, but I'll find something to do with them. Um, I got this. Oh, <laughs> snowman is hanging upside down <laughs> I'm falling there is a mirror which is meant to use like for a, a pond or something 
That's a good thing to have. Never know when you might want to make something like that. And then there's this one here. A, an ornament. Let's see here. I think this is two different ones. Yep. There is this metal snow or snow reindeer. And he's got like a little um, scarf around his neck. So that's a metal reindeer. And then there's this one here that says Noel. Ah, this one's adorable. I love this. It's metal and it is a Christmas stocking. And plaid. Which is what I put plaid, all kind of plaid on me. Tree. Now we have, uh, <laughs> it looks like a mom and a dad and a little kid. And they are Christmas caroling. And then there is Santa. And he's, I don't know what he's doing to Rudolph. He's trying to get him to get him to go, I think. That's what it looks like. And then we have, oh, I'll have to give this to my granddaughter. I'll have to touch it up, though. A bumblebee ornament. Oh. Uh, a raggedy Ann ornament. Ornament, yeah, ornament. And an apple. I like those metal ones, they're cool. And a sunflower. This looks like a homemade one. A little snowman. And these snowmen with the lights on them. Little ladybug ornament. Another apple. And this is just a boy and a girl. He's got his arm around her. Here's one of a little girl with an, a snowman. And here is just a round ornament. Here's one of a little boy pulling his teddy bear on a sled. And another Raggedy Ann. And uh, another one of these of the family caroling. Oh, and I guess that's it.
That's super cool. I'll put them all back in there. And then the last things I got were these earrings were on a card, but they took them off. They reused their cards, apparently. Straighten down here. These little Christmas uh, earrings, which I think are very cute. And then there's this brooch, and it has, it's a little watch hanging off of it. I'm going to have to change the battery, because I don't think it's one that you wind. No, nope, it's quartz. So I will have to change the battery or I'll go in and have it changed. Um, I can probably just change it myself. Let me see if it's going to be very hard. That eh, shouldn't be too hard. I think this is really cute. I like that a lot. And so that is my stuff. I think that's what I bought. And these are my gifts. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And uh, until I see you in my next video, take care of yourselves. Have a great weekend. It's going to rain here, but have a great weekend anyway and where you're at. And um, yeah, and I will see you in my next video. Um, I do believe I am going to be recording um, a drop sale here in just a little while. Um, it'll probably be about 20 items. I thought you might be interested in that. And after I have some lunch, I'm going to run to the post office and mail the um, items that people have paid for, their, have paid their invoices, so I can them out to you guys and I would that's what my that's what my day looks like today so take care love you guys and uh, thank you so much for all that you do I love my subscribers if you don't if you're not subscribed please subscribe and join the family of crafty people <laughs> Soon I will be crafting, and you'll see me crafting. I will actually show you that I do craft. All right, guys. Take it easy. Bye.